Hi, my name is Corbin Manson. I'm with the Invasive Species Council of BC. Today we're here in beautiful Boundary Bay doing manual removal of Daphne or Spurge Laurel. Scientific name is Daphne Laureola. It grows up to a meter and a half tall. It's a perennial evergreen shrub with these glossy green leaves. The leaves of Daphne Laurel are four to 13 centimeters long, sort of a glossy green. They're wider at the center, they narrow towards the base, and they grow alternate in whorls on the stem. The fruits are egg-shaped. Immature fruits are dark green to light green, and the mature fruits are black. We've just missed flowering, but the flowers are pale green to yellow, small flowers, bell-shaped as well. And that's what eventually turns into these fruits here. One of the problems with Daphne is that it has a toxic sap and the berries are toxic as well. So when we're working with Daphne, we need to be using all our PPE. So gloves and goggles are essential here when we're doing manual removal. It's one of the reasons we want to get it out of Boundary Bay Park as well, because it poses a threat to people and their pets as well. And, and we want to make sure that people can enjoy this beautiful space safely. Best practices for removing spurge laurel include cutting below the mineral soil as low as you can to prevent re-sprouting. So on this one, we've gone just below what we call the root collar, which is where you, instead of putting out stems, it puts out roots, and that's to prevent re-sprouting. Like any invasive species, Daphne is fast growing and regenerates really effectively. So we want to be following up on any sites that we've done management at at least a couple of times within a year after treatment to make sure that we can remove any of those new sprouts.